Hello, everybody. Welcome back to the flagship program for us here at rvccis.info. A program, sooner or later, you guys will help us name because flagship program just, it's not working for me anymore. Um, we are your hosts, the RVCCIS faculty. Um, in your upper left-hand corner is Jim Conley. Say hi, Jim. Hey, hey. Down from that, we've got Chuck Conkle. Hello, afternoon. Across we have Stephanie Washer. Hi. And me, Eric Wolf. On today's episode, um, we'll do a how the faculty plan to spend their summer vacation. We are working saps just <laughs> like you. Uh, so that'll be our quick hit today for ep the, you, you don't know it yet, but this is episode one of two for an ultra mega mega marathon of recording. So um, it, if, you know, if anybody watching thinks like that CIS faculty, they never change. They like literally they're closed. They're in the same stuff. It's because we're recording two of these. So don't worry about that. We shower, I assure you. Um, yeah, and I own like 20 green hoodies. <laughs> yeah, I, my, my students think it's like a uniform, like is Wolf in another hoodie? Yes, well, there you go. So uh, at least we're consistent. All right, does anybody want to start us off? What is your plan for summer vacation? There's a big pause there. That means I can start. Well, my mom oh, no. has banned oh, me into going to Chautauqua, Wisconsin in June. Mm. So, yeah, we're kind of, am I, am I going out again? Yeah, we're cutting out again. This is the Ooh, problem Jim's, with live filming. Must be me. Yep, there it went again. Well, yeah. just like everybody else, the internet connection is unstable now. So it's, it's fine. I think. <laughs> Uh, internet imitates life. That's the best way to go about it. Just edit, right, Eric? Go ahead. Yeah, yeah. We'll just edit <laughs> go that again, out. Stephanie. Try it again, Stephanie. I'll try it again. <laughs> so, uh, my mom and my uncle were supposed to go fishing in Chautauqua, Wisconsin, but my uncle had a stroke, so he could not, um, he's not up to par as what he'd like to be. So, uh, she talked me into going. So we're going to go in June and we're going to go fishing. <laughs> Just my mom and I. It's going to be fun. <laughs> be some good stories on that. I said, mom, I don't clean fish. I don't know how to do that. She goes, oh, I got that down. So evidently we're going to fish and she'll yeah. clean them and, and, and cook them for me. So what else can I ask for? <laughs> good job. Yeah. Mm. Perfect. And I think Brad and I are going to go to Michigan. Well, hopefully, if Michigan opens up in July or August, we'll see what happens. Mm -hmm. cool. well, yeah, that's true. Me, we were supposed to take uh, my dad's Brian retiring. And go ahead, Chuck. Go ahead. I will go ahead. No, you go ahead. Um, I was supposed to actually starting Sunday. Um, we were supposed to be in Minnesota for a week with my folks. We had rented, well, we had almost rented. Uh, luckily, I was too lazy to have said yes yet before all of this happened. Um, there was a, um, a coach for the Minnesota Vikings must rent his house out. So it's got all this Vikings crap in it. Mm -hmm. But it's this huge house. It has a dojo in it. It's very strange. Hmm. Um, but we were supposed to spend a week up there, but not anymore. Mm -hmm. yeah. Okay. Uh, well, for me, it'd be grandkids, definitely, you know, so I'll show, definitely show some pictures here. Oh, yeah, please do. One reason right there, this little guy. He's here. cute. Oh. He's, he's cute. That's what we call him. We'll be with that guy and, and all the other grandkids. I don't have all the other ones close here, but you got Lucy, you got Quentin, Mackenzie, um, and then the whole gang. You can see there. And so uh, I'll send you some photos. But anyway, uh, hanging out with them. My sister's moving from Missouri to Alabama, where her husband is from. And they're, out, you know, they're moving like in the next month or selling their home. So we usually have a reunion at her home in Missouri. So this time we'll probably have it at my, uh, my uncle's, which is right down the road from Kelly. And uh, we have about – Brothers and sisters, which now I have living uh, two sisters and one brother, and then probably about 10 cousins, and then 10 second cousins. And then we meet all together and get in a lot of trouble and 
<laughs> so, but we have fun and a good time. And, uh, and so basically reunion with family and hugging, hugging my grandkids for sure. Definitely. That would be nice. Awesome. Jim, take us out. Uh, I'll be on my bike. And then when I'm done with that, I'll get back on my bike. And when that's over, I'll get on my bike one more time. <laughs> and Cindy and I will just do power walks through our neighborhood, and we're not going anywhere this summer. We're just hanging out. Yeah. That's the way you like it, the cheapest way. I, this has the Conley <laughs> stamp of approval. I can sense it. <laughs> exactly. Exactly. Okay. See, we're just as boring as the rest of everybody else. We are... <laughs> Uh, my, yeah, I mean, like now that we're not going anywhere that frees up all this extra money for me to get like the house repaired, which kind of stinks too. But, uh, so wow. I had six people out today for gutters, windows, and, uh, um, glass block. So, woo, you know, super yeah, exciting. Yeah. Exciting. Mm -hmm. exciting. Well, God, it's going to be so Jim, expensive. Jim and I. Yeah, Jim and I are redoing the labs this summer for the net labs. We are actually. Yeah. Yeah. I'm yeah, I didn't want I didn't want to be totally boring, but you're right, Stephanie. So we're doing uh Cisco. <laughs> we're revamping all of Cisco all summer. Nice. So we'll be geeking out on that. Oh yeah, that'll be fun. It will be. Mm -hmm. Yeah. But I didn't think people students would want to hear, oh, that's all he really does. Is he's that boring? Yeah. All four yeah, of we just us are there. gonna be working this summer. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I will probably play a little guitar. Um, I've got like six guitars that I never played all all semester, so I'll probably play those. I got a new cigar box guitar I bought in Galena, hey. Illinois, from a gentleman down south that builds them, but from scratch. And so I'll get to play that. And um, Jim knows about this, but I'll probably up my riding on my Peloton. I, I'm doing about Good. ten miles a day right now. And so my goal is the summer to do six days a week, 15 miles a day. I'm, I'm now doing 10 miles a day. So that's good. Uh, yeah, it's been, it's been enjoyable. I've, I've, been, I've liked doing it. It's, uh, it's, it's easier to, to gain weight, I found out, though, and more enjoyable <laughs> than it is to lose weight. <laughs> yeah, that is true. It is not fun. Anybody says it's fun. Yeah, the instructors on Peloton and Jim. I know you have on your app, on yours that you use, these guys are like totally um, fit. They're, they have no issues whatsoever. And they make it look so easy. <laughs> yeah. So easy. It's funny because they'll give a range, right, to work out. Uh, in a Peloton, you can tighten up the resistance is what they call it. And they say, okay, guys, we're doing 30, 50 resistance right now. If 40 is too easy for you, bump it up to 60. Cause that's pretty, that's right where I go. Right. Oh, that's where I can't bow at. Like I'm staying at 40. I'm good, yeah, I'm yeah. good. I'm good at 40. <laughs> so, oh, no. but they make it look so easy, not even sweating 40 minutes into it. So mm -hmm. uh, on the other hand, you don't want to see me after my 45 minute workout. That's for sure. You definitely <laughs> don't want to see me. <laughs> it's scary. <laughs> Well, okay, that you can tell by the silence when our energy comes down like yes. that, that's as good a time as any to end the show. Um, that was what the RVC CIS faculty is doing over summer. Uh, do us a favor, hit the like and subscribe button to see more great content like this. Leave us some comments if you have any ideas for shows down the road, things we might improve. Um, you know, tell us to get lost, whatever. It's nice to know that there's somebody out there um, watching. As always, we have been your hosts, Jim, Chuck, Stephanie, and myself, Eric. Um, and as always, stay safe and stay sane out there. <laughs>